Jordan thinks the future of artificial intelligence could be closer than we think. In fact, one school at Ector County ISD has successfully managed to incorporate it into every single one of its classrooms through what it calls blended learning. News West 9's Lily Beth Vias gives us a closer look into how AI is being used to enhance learning. Our students, when you walk into the classroom, they're so engaged. They're not sitting in seats, bored. It's not a sit and get anymore. It's a new age of learning at Ector County ISD's Pease Elementary through the use of blended learning. What is it? Personalized learning for students. So it is, you may, in, with 20 kids in a classroom, you are gonna have kids that are on grade level, kids that are below grade level, and kids that are above grade level. Blended learning allows for the leveraging of adaptive software, good quality tier one grade level instruction, and then data driven interventions. Ms. Eretz is a principal at Pease Elementary. So we just finished year three of implementation of blended learning. So we started out um, with about four teachers who just were willing to give it a shot. But during the 2023-2024 school year. This year, every, everyone, even our pre-K classrooms are doing blended. It's education at the fingertips of nearly 600 students with the use of tablets that have programs like My Math Academy and My Reading Academy. Which is the, our adaptive software that we use through Age of Learning. And then iStation is, this year was the reading uh, diagnostic that we used to, teachers are able to utilize um, assessments and data in an intentional way. You're not just taking a test to take a test. You do have the concern of, I don't want my child on a device all day, and that's not the reality. Um, they still get that face-to-face -face tier one instruction, which is grade level instruction, and then there is a certain amount of time each day that they spend on the adaptive software. The use of these tablets vary according to the student. They're often used in rotations, that can last nearly 90 minutes a day. They do 60 minutes of my math academy a week. Ms. Eretz says the use of this software doesn't fill the teacher's role. Instead, it gives educators Have that intentional time with every kid, not with just the ones that are struggling, not with just your grade level kids, not with your high kids, every kid. In Odessa, Lily Bethias, News West 9.